Should we talk to Gale? Does he like parties? Beautiful night, don't you think? Nothing like a brush with destruction to make one appreciate the majesty of a celestial canvas. It's a view I would once have shared with my companion. Though definitely unaccompanied by such revelry. She preferred it when we were alone. Curled up before a crackling hearth with some ancient esoteric tome between us. Ink glinting in the firelight. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of curious who he's referring to. His, uh, do we think, it sounds like it's kind of a former lover. We could assume that. Or maybe he's talking about his cat. We know he has a cat. I think let's say, who are you referring to? A former lover, perhaps. Fire, Geron's lost nose. No! It is, you are talking about your cat? Like Tara. Oh, okay. <laughs> Assistant. My constant companion through all the ills and tribulations my hubris has thrust upon me. She'd be most impressed by our efforts saving these tieflings. Proud, even. And I've given her little to be proud of recently. After I was afflicted with my condition. I locked myself in my tower for an entire year. It was inconsolable. Wallowing in my self-inflicted tragedy. I've given up on myself. Tara never did. It was her encouragement, her research that led me to my treatment. Once we knew that magically infused items were the key, she went out to find them for me. She saved my life. After so long being cared for by someone else, it feels good to have repaid the favor. Not directly to Tara, but to these poor tieflings. I'm sure she would approve. It's nice. Am I jealous? Hmm, depends. Depends if you still got connections that might get in the way. Um. What is Tara like? You remind me of her somewhat. There's a steeliness in you. An unwavering tenacity, even in the face of, to be frank, quite dire odds. He says sure that so cheerfully. Make a formal introduction. But I would never ask her to undertake such a journey. She's safer at home. Besides, she was always telling me I needed to spread my wings, so to speak. Find mortal friends instead of hanging onto Mistress coattails. So that's what I'm doing. I hope. He's looking for mortal friends. Okay. <laughs> Bad luck on that front. I'm actually a nymph in disguise, JK. Um... None of these are are great options unless we want to like mess with them a little bit. Um, well, let's say you don't have any friends. Sadly not. If I'm being entirely honest, my social circle is rather small. More of a dot or a pinhead. I've got acquaintances, certainly. Plenty of colleagues. Friends? Those are precious indeed. I hope. Though we've only known each other for a short time, I might be able to count you among that number. Hell yeah, Gail, we're friends. Of course, I hope we might be more than friends. No, we're going with number three. Friends with the mighty Gale of Waterdeep. I'd be honored. Pinhead Larry. <laughs> to know you enjoy my company is... Well, it's rather wonderful, actually. I'd be loath to waste the time of someone who's become rather important to me. Hmm. Oh, there's a lot of, like, options here. Let's see. I think we go for number two. Actually, I was thinking we'd be wonderful, like, together. Wait. Are you saying... I'm not saying anything, Gail. You know what? He approves. I think I've clearly had far too much white. <laughs> and you've had nowhere near enough. I think this is a conversation best held back on. For now. With my condition mm. as volatile as it is, I fear any undue... excitement may tip it over the edge. So to speak. Go. I've got... Indulge in the frivolities. They're good for the heart. And mine will be all the lighter to see you enjoying yourself. Listen, Gail, I have a chest full of magical items waiting for you to consume them. Don't worry about it. 
Stone bed. Okay. Let's talk to Volo. Aha, there you are. Come now, settle in. I do hope you have partaken of something bracing. This may well take us all night. What? Wait, by this you mean what? Why, your naming, quite obviously. Oh. That ballad was but a crude preview, a frame without its crowning jewel. Your nom de guerre. It's right back you to Something invite him to see. Iconic, but not too much of a mouthful. We don't want to exclude the common folk after all. I intend this tale to enrapture all. Uh... Ooh. Oh, what's up, Dope? Welcome in. How's it going? Let's see. I want to see what he suggests, because Grove Keeper sounds cool, but, like, what do you have in mind? Far too much. This is the very problem. I'm if doing great, you thank you. Many triumphs, carry out one defining act. Mm -hmm. Not to belittle your achievements today, of course, but besting a dragon, a giant, a god, perhaps? Hmm. I must deliberate. Go. Enjoy your evening. I shall have work for you in the days to come. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna let him come up with something cool and like pitch it to me and then we'll decide. Hope you're enjoying the night here, right? I don't think I, I know her. Am. Cheers to many more like this. Okay, cheers. Yeah, I don't think I've met you before. Halson, I know Go you though. Now. Don't waste a night like this talking to me. We'll discuss your problem tomorrow. Right. Um, I thought you might care to have a drink with me. In truth, I rarely imbibe. The stuff goes right to my head. Before you know it, I'd be breaking into song or declaring love to the first person I laid eyes on. He feel I feel like he very much gestured to me there. He was like, you? Hmm. Hmm. Perhaps there's something else you'd rather do then. <laughs> there's just, they give you so many chances to get with every character in this freaking game. <laughs> I'm sure there are. You strike me as extremely resourceful. Mm -hmm. But there are many grateful people here who want to spend time with you. I must not keep you all to myself, as enjoyable as that may be. Go on, enjoy yourself. Seek out some wine before it runs dry. There are a lot of thirsty people around here. You know, as a bard, I feel like it's my obligation to flirt with everyone all the time. Who are you? You look like a bard. This might be the wine talking, but I'm feeling inspired. Thinking of writing my next song about you. Cool. But I need an angle. Any ideas? Hmm. Oh, we have some bard options. Let it be only as truthful as true poetry would permit. But of course, you achieved something far beyond mere fact. That deserves to be remembered. Sweet. We should play some music for the party, right? Let's talk to some people first, and then we'll do that. You have no idea how good it feels to see these people smiling. The singing we could probably do without. But even so, thank you. It's a party. OK, that's all he had to say. Lazelle, you're not into the party? I have seen the Kithraki tear a screaming Neogi's legs from its belly to fashion into blades. Yet, they could not match your nerve today. It was enough to drive me to madness. A pity for us both you've turned your back on me so often. What does she mean? Um... I'm grateful for your aid. You're a gifted warrior. Vlakith demands of me no less. If only you'd earned the right to lay at my side. Come morning, you will wonder. You will wonder how my lips might have tasted. How Where my is this coming from? Might have felt. Oh, but do enjoy yourself this night. I intend to myself. I just don't understand where she's coming from with that. I have made no moves towards her. At all. I'm looking for her her outfit. Her um camp outfit. Because I stole it, but I'm not wearing it anymore, so I was gonna give it back. I don't know where it is though. I may have put it away. Whatever. She can wear a shirt. She's fine. Um let's see. 
There is someone over here. Mole, mole, give me back my backpack. You came through for us. Mole's That's missing an eye? From most adults I know. Hmm. Indeed, and now you owe me. I don't owe anyone. But if you mind your give manners, your backpack. maybe I'll remember you when I'm running the gate. Ah, <sighs> oh, mole. I'm never gonna get that backpack back. I think that quest is bugged, honestly. Remember what happened last time? Starion, you're next. You know, I never pictured myself as a hero. Never thought I'd be the one they toast for saving so many lives. And now that I'm here. I hate it. This is awful. He doesn't like it? Um, you did a good thing, so suck it up and enjoy yourself. Enjoy myself? There's a worm in my brain. I'm surrounded by idiots, and all I've got to drink is wine that tastes like vinegar. Hmm. Uh, take his bottle and try the wine. It's a heavy, rich red. Dry and sharp. See what I mean? Awful. I'm pretty sure I all liked I it. Want is a little fun. Is that so much to ask? Um. There's so many. Okay, we're a bard. What's your idea of a little fun? By the hells, sex, my dear. A night of passion. Uh huh. Enough with you. Just to be clear. <laughs> I mean, Just... <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> Ugh. No. Wow, he's so rude. <laughs> anyway, don't let me keep you. I'm sure you have someone else to sniff around. Oh my god, he's so rude. Okay, where is your shadow heart? She's not partying. Everyone seems to be in high spirits. Strange. You know who I never thought I'd find myself caring for? Um... Me? Your words, not mine. But not what I mean. I mean... Desperate people. Like those refugees. Never gave them much thought. Certainly not that bunch in the grove. Yet we came through for them. We saved their lives. Odd. Hmm. Um... Not so odd, we did the right thing. That's more easily said by some than others. But nobody's here to debate right from wrong. Shadowheart trails off and glances around at the party. She turns back to you, mildly surprised you're still there. Is she drunk? I thought you might have wanted to mingle with the others. Um, there'll be time for that later. True. But I thought you might not want to linger with me. We haven't always seen eye to eye, after all. Besides, I'm sure there's plenty of people who'll be keen to celebrate most thoroughly with you. Hmm. Maybe I'd like to celebrate with you. Maybe you would. But I'm not cruel enough to get your hopes up, in spite of what some might believe. Hmm. I think I could win you over if I wanted to. Oh, you do, do you? I'm not some dewy-eyed tiefling maiden you just saved. You'll need to do a lot more legwork before I commit to any hip work. Wow. So funny. Oh, we can start community polls for these choices. That's good. We'll, we'll try Not on this one, but we'll try that at some point. Um... I understand. Before I go, how can we see eye to eye? What? Some advice on how to make me more bearable? All right, if you like. I'm not half as mysterious as you might think. Respect my privacy, my beliefs. Keep us focused on finding a cure. If you do that, well, I see no reason why we shouldn't get closer. Yarna, welcome in. Now, how are you doing? About me. Haven't you seen the way Gale's been stealing looks at you? Go on. See if you want something. Or someone. I already talked to Gail. 
He turned me down, I'm pretty sure. And who do we got? Doing all right, that's good to hear. Uh, I'm doing well. We're just, uh, we're at a party in Baldur's right now. We, we saved these tieflings, now they're at my camp. Everyone's drinking, they're all propositioning themselves to various people. It's going great. Look at them all. Guzzling poison like with the right to be happy. This guy's not having a good time. Um, Charisma, you should join them. Have a pint or two. It's a DC5, bro. You're gonna love this party. Hmm. Perhaps it'll make the evening more tolerable. Yeah, don't be a bummer. It's a party, bro. Withers, I don't think you party, so I'm not gonna bother with you. Um, who's out here? Oh, Will's all the way out there. All right, let's go talk to Will. He's way out in the boonies. Yeah, hells. I was hoping you wouldn't notice I was gone. Um, of course I noticed. It was no party without you, Will. Really? I'm honored. In truth, I don't feel in a festive mood, and I didn't want to cast a gray cloud over the night. These people are still in danger. Karlak, the creature from hell, will still threaten them, as will a thousand other perils. They aren't ready to get on the road on their own. Hmm. Let's see. We have won this day. Danger is for tomorrow. <laughs> Your words cheer me more than any party could. But, off with you. This is your day. Have a dance. Enjoy the music. No worries, Yarnam. I totally understand that. Not wanting spoilers on this one. It's such a it's such a big game, too. Um, it's been really fun, though. And I'm so glad you dropped by. Let's see. I want to dance with you, Will. <laughs> In truth, I always enjoyed a bit of pomp. I once beat the Baldron record for the most sarabans danced in a single evening. I don't know what Much that means. Much to the exhaustion of the good ladies and gentlemen of the gate. I imagine you're fairly skilled with your form, too. That would be a sight to behold. Well, I'm a bard, so I imagine... A fine figure. I am pretty good. I can just imagine leading you with an entire ballroom watching. But who am I fooling? I can't go back to that life. Why not? Oh, I can persuade him to kiss me. Oh, no worries. Sounds good, Yarnum. I totally, I really, really understand. I have, like, been avoiding spoilers of this game for so long. All right, we've decided we're flirting with everyone, so how about a kiss, Will? What's the DC? Oh, it's, it's kind of high, but, um, we're friends. Hey, we got him. We got him. He did call me fine. That's true. It is hard to avoid because everyone's playing this, I feel like. Come on, Will. 25? You're not going to kiss me for a 25? You drive a hard bargain. Oh, he agreed. But just the one. Oh, my God. Will approves. He looks awkward about it, though. Wow. OK, that was a little I... <clears throat> sad, well, guys. Then, um, you've got a party to get back to. After all, tonight is about you. Thanks, Will. There will be another time for us. <laughs> Look at that red glow around him because I charmed him. <laughs> Sorry, Will. It had to be done. I couldn't lose that. Who are you, Gwex? Think of it. No more caves. No more tents. Will no is a cutie. We'll be in a city with roads and markets and... Homes. Okay, Chloe. Chloe, you know who this guy reminds me of? He reminds me of the credits brother guys from uh from Kotor. He's got that same vibe going on. Okay, did I talk to everyone? I feel like I did, so let's play a song for these guys. Bard dance. Let's see. My performance check went off well. Let's make sure Gail gets a spot. Yes, he's totally like that.
Dang, they love me, guys. <laughs> Look at this. This is a party. 